he heads back to school to hone her road racing skills. Up next on Dirt Rider Adventures. I'm in Pahrump, Nevada at Formula Extreme Champion AMA Superbike Racer Jason Pridmore's Star School. Now this is a prime opportunity for riders of all skill levels to come out and better on what they know. Knowledge is power and the more you know about your bike, the safer you ride. So I'm all suited up. I'm ready to go learn something. Let's go. Should be a blast. Whether you're an average street rider looking to improve your skills, confidence to become a safer rider, or a high performance rider or racer looking for answers on how to go faster on the racetrack, the Star Motorcycle School has a training program to teach you all the angles. When it comes to learning the angles, you might as well learn from a pro. And in this case, the lead instructor is former AMA Super Sport Champion and current World Endurance Champion Jason Pridmore. This was something that I was kind of approached with uh, about six years ago with Suzuki. I thought it would be a, a, a great thing to do because I always wanted to pass something along to students and that's why I decided, decided to do it. We go all over the country, we go uh, all the way back to New Hampshire, you know, from California to New Hampshire and we run about 32 dates uh, a year. And then obviously when I get done racing, maybe in a few years, you know, we'll be able to run more schools. So what do you need to attend the Star Motorcycle School? It's simple. You need to have a minimum of one year of riding experience. Of course you need a bike, which must have a displacement of at least 250 cc's. The mirrors need to be removed or taped over, the taillights disabled or taped over, the engine in good running condition, and it must have decent tires. And finally, you need proper riding gear, including full coverage leathers or equivalents, leather or Kevlar riding gloves, leather riding boots, and a DOT approved full faced helmet that is less than five years old. After a few necessary check-in duties, like the good old sign your life away track waiver, Molly hit the classroom for some mandatory riding and safety instruction. Let's ask a couple questions about that line. Let's ask a couple questions. How many of you right now feel confident that you can lean your bike over as far as possibly go to the right and as far as possibly go to the left? Let's ask a couple questions. Okay. With the morning instruction under the belt, it was time to suit up and hit the track. All right. Let's roll. The school is typically broken up into groups based on skill levels and rider ambitions. But the first laps of the day are always limited to safety instruction sessions. Some of the most valuable skills can be learned from the side of the track. The star team spends a lot of time hot lapping the crucial corners so that the students can see firsthand the right and wrong way to approach, negotiate, and to exit a corner at speed. Now what's important here? Getting out of 5A, getting out of 5B. Like we said, learn from the pros and you'll learn fast. This is my first time out here at a, at a track school. I'm um, actually a Motorcycle Safety Foundation instructor for the state of Utah, and this is part of a professional development. And it's a lot of fun to kind of apply some of these same techniques. And here's some of the same techniques from the Motorcycle Safety Foundation, or MSF, that we do all the time, and only in a safe environment with nobody coming the other direction. Up next, Molly hits the track for a solo cat and mouse session with Jason. 